Welcome to Mist. I'm Coach Nikita, and this is lesson number 23 of Green Ball. Let's talk shoulder high shots, contact zone three and above, so which is shoulder and above. Okay, most likely this shot will be hit at chord zone level, uh, chord zone two or one. Uh, this is a soft, easy shot. Uh, usually it's called a, like a put away shot. Um, it's a little bit different. Uh, in the terms of the finish okay now the finish for the green ball that we've talked before goes to here but now we're actually gonna uh, keep our hands up and we're going to follow through to the shoulder right here so we're actually gonna have a further finish on our forehand as opposed to the actual stroke that we use uh, during green ball okay so the finish will be for the next level okay so this is going to be like an exception to the regular forehand eventually once we get to the yellow ball then we will add that finish okay so once again let's say you are the net here's what it looks like I get my hands up I set it up here as opposed to setting it down here it's up here and there's a maybe a slight drop and pushing through the ball and finishing at the shoulder okay don't make it complex it's very simple it's the same stroke just keep the hands up focus on just that part and then following through to the shoulder okay very important on this one the feet do not move we don't want them moving the only idea here is get your right foot to the ball just like any forehand Get your right foot to the ball, set it up, come up, hit the shot, and then fall to the other side. Okay? Don't want your feet jumping uh, or uh, off balance. Okay? So with your athlete, what you're going to do is first thing, you want to try and set the feet. Okay? So you will be tossing a nice easy ball, nice high ball. They will come up and they will set the feet. Well, they, they will not hit and I want them in the set position not here but right here okay so they're about to hit that ball okay so it's right over there once they've set up nicely and you do that 10 in a row because that's what we want we want consistency then you're giving them permission to hit the ball now the key here may be maybe sometimes not use the net right away but maybe use a fence okay because and that young athlete is a really focused on results especially in today's world you know where grades all are like everything and the process is nothing okay so we want to make sure that the process is what they're looking for okay so what happens to the racket as it passes through the ball through the contact zone and where does it finish okay and we want it finishing by the shoulder once you do a little bit of that and they get a little bit comfortable now start having them hit across the net okay and you want to get as different ranges or different depths on the ball you might want to ask them okay I want you to hit past the baseline now I understand that's out but the point here is to understand the different ranges hit past the baseline hit into hit just within the baseline hit try and hit into the service box which is difficulty in and of itself okay uh, afterwards you will be hitting uh, cross court or down the line and then obviously rotating alternating between cross court and down the line and the idea here is to understand the depth the full depth of the stroke okay understanding how to come up how to set the hands how to set the feet what the follow-through is and where you will be aiming okay and all those things are key to executing a good shoulder high shots all right fantastic i'll see you guys next time bye bye